When I was nine years old, 1947, my dad had purchased a Swift, which was a type of aircraft. He bought it from Al Vogel, who happened to be a dealer from the Vogel Dairy. Well, uh, dad wanted to take me on a flying trip to visit friends in Montana. And it was August of 47. Uh, it had rained the night before we were to take off. Dad Swift was out at the old field. He thought it might be a little too muddy to load it down, so load the plane there. So he soloed over to the new airport and where my mother dropped me and my luggage off and my dad and I took off from this airport. Now that's how we date the age of the uh, Fairburn Municipal Field today back to, I think it was probably developed in 46, was probably active. There were guys doing first flights out of there before that, but my f experience there started in 1947. I developed relationships with other pilots, and, and then um, in 1976, um, there was a seat open on the on the, uh, at what was then just the Faribault Airport board. But it was very informal at that point. And I took that seat and I've been there ever since. I just, I'm reminded once in a while that I might be the senior citizen down there now, but doesn't, nonetheless, uh, uh, and I've always enjoyed that relationship with the city. The city, in its growth, uh, they were getting more and more professional about the way they were organizing the, uh, the committees around town. And so um, we just went from an informal, uh, let's say, group of guys that, uh, that had an interest in the Faribault and, and the, the city, the mayor and so on, would occasionally stop by and, and give you an attaboy and, and life went on. Well, uh, in looking at my notes to prepare for this, I saw that Mayor Hammond, back in 1995, was part of the administration that established the Planning Commission, the uh, uh, Heritage Foundation Group, and the airport, the formal Air, airport advisory board. That tornado in, in uh, what, 2018, September 2018, uh, was a godsend in terms of of uh, bringing fresh new investment, not only by the FAA, MnDOT, but also certain individual commercial operators at the field. North Memorial uh, Air Care. Uh, now this new Stein Air that's out there. Beautiful jobs, job uh, 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 employer. Rare aircraft has been very prominent out there. The airport is a greater uh, asset to the city than many of us realize. <laughs>